Hello, this is Mr. Ahmed and today we'll do lesson 2.5 make bar graphs and our essential question is how can you draw a bar graph to show data in a table or picture graph okay so let's unlock the problem Jordan took a survey of his classmates favorite team sports he recorded the results in the table at the right how can he show the results in a bar graph okay so we need to turn this table into a bar graph okay so let's look at the steps here step number one write a title at the top to tell what the bar graph is about okay so the title here is favorite team sport so here we write favorite team sport okay here let's continue label the side of the graph to tell about the bars so here at the side we will write sport and here let's write the sports soccer basketball baseball football baseball football okay step number two it shows numbers for the bottom of the graph so that most of the bars will end on a line since the least number is 4 and the greatest number is 14 so make the scale from 0 to 16 mark the scale by 2 okay so down here we will write the number of votes and we will start counting by twos so here zero two four six eight ten twelve fourteen sixteen okay then here is tip number three draw and shade the bars to show the number for each sport okay so let's see the first sport is soccer so here we have 5, 10, 11, 12. So here for the soccer we need to make it 12. So we will make the bar until the 12 here. Okay. And then we will shade it. The next game is basketball and the basketball is four. So here okay. So I'll draw it like this and the length should be four. Then we should shade it like this. So guys remember to use your pencil or ruler to make it perfect okay the next one is baseball baseball is this is 5 10 11 12 13 14 so for baseball we need to make it 14 okay so we'll go until the 14 like this and then we shade it okay then the last one is football football is let's count this means five six seven eight nine so the football is nine okay so nine guys this is eight 
this is 10 so it should be in the middle between 8 and 10 so it should be right here okay now let's shade it like this and this is how we draw the bar graph okay here the share and show Matt's school is having a walkathon to raise money for the school library Matt made a picture graph to show the number of miles some students walked make a bar graph of Matt's data use a scale of 0 to plank and mark the scale by plank okay so here each picture or each chart like this means two miles okay so here we have two four six eight ten so here we have ten here two four and half of the shirt half of the two is one so two four and this means one so it will be five here pin is two here Erica two four six eight okay so as you can see the number the smallest is two and the biggest is ten so for example we can say make the scale from zero to twelve and we can count by twos here okay so you just choose the suitable scale depending on the problem or the numbers that you have okay here so here we write the title school walk Athon and here at the left we we'll write the number of miles which is we said zero two four six eight ten twelve and down here we write the name of the students okay so the names here we have Sam, Matt, Ben, and Erica. So here, Sam, Matt, Ben, and Erica. Okay, and here we will draw our bar graph. Okay, so for Sam, it's a 10. So for Sam, we will go to 10. So 10 is here. So this is Sam. Okay, let's draw them and shade them at the end. Okay, here we have Matt is 5. Okay, so Matt is 5 use your pencil or ruler guys so guys this is four and this is six so five should be in the middle here between four and six okay so this is math five then ben is two okay so ben is two just right here and then Erica is eight. So two, four, six, eight is just right here. And let's shade all of the bars. Okay, down here we have some questions. Which student walked the most miles? Okay.
Okay, so as you can see here, Sam is the longest bar, which is actually 10. So Sam is the student who walked the most miles. Okay, so here, how many more miles would Matt have had to walk to equal the number of miles Erica walked? So here he asks about Matt. How many miles had to walk to equal the number of miles Erica walked? So Matt is Matt is five, and Erica is eight. So after five, six, seven, eight. So he need to walk three more miles. Okay, so from 5 to 8, it's 3. So, Matt need to walk 3 more miles. So, 3 more miles. And here, number 3, how many miles did the students walk? So, we need the total number here. So, Sam is 10, Matt 5, Ben 2, and Erica 8. So 10 plus 5 plus 2 plus 8. So 10 plus 5 plus 2 plus 8. So 10 plus 5 is 15 plus 2 which is 17 plus 8 is 25. So it's 25 miles. Okay, here number four, write the number of miles the students walked in order from greatest to least. Okay, so we need to arrange the numbers 10, 5, 2, and 8 from the greatest to least. So the greatest is 10, then 8, then 5, then 2. Okay, hope you guys enjoyed this lesson. Have a nice day and goodbye.